Welcome to PTI Sports Wrap at 6. Here are the top stories. Kolkata Knight Riders entered their fourth IPL final with a thumping 8 wicket win over Sunrisers Hyderabad in Qualifier 1 in Ahmedabad on Tuesday. Mitchell Stark struck thrice in the power play as KKR bowled out Sunrisers Hyderabad for 159. Rahul Tripathi top score for SRH with 55 of 35 balls, while Henrik Klaassen smashed 32 of 21 balls. The 62 run stand between Tripathi and Klaassen was the lone positive in an otherwise underwhelming batting effort. KKR then gunned down the target in 13.4 overs thanks to Venkatesh Ayer and skipper Shreyas Ayer's unbeaten knocks. Sanju Samson's Rajasthan Royals will face a stern test of character as they look to arrest a shocking slide in a do-or-die IPL eliminator against an informed Royal Challengers Bengaluru in Ahmedabad on Wednesday. Rajasthan Royals are coming off four losses and a rained off game. RCB have notched up six consecutive wins to sound a warning to their rivals they mean business in the playoff. RR, the 2008 IPL winners, suddenly find themselves as the underdogs when a couple of weeks ago they were red-hot favourites. India's Ekta Bayan secured the gold medal in a seasoned West throw of 20.12 meter in the women's F51 club throw competition at the World Para Athletic Championships in Kobe, Japan. Ekta had also won the gold medal in the club throw event at the 2018 Asian Para Games in Jakarta and had also qualified for the Tokyo 2020 Paralympics. India's tally has now rose to five medals, two gold, three silver, and two bronze. The championships will continue until May 25. Former India opener Gautam Gambhir loves the IPL and the quality of cricket it produces but doesn't want the franchise-based T20 league to become the pathway to Indian team for youngsters. The Golkata Knight Riders team mentor, however, asserted that the IPL has benefited the Indian domestic cricketers. Gambhir also clarified that it does not need to smile since the fans come to watch him help the team win and that all he cares about is players giving their 100% on the field. Australian cricket team coach Andrew McDonald said on Tuesday that charismatic young batter Jake Fraser McGurk and all rounder Matthew Short have been added as travelling reserves with the squad for the T20 World Cup in the Americas because they bring something different to the table. The two reserves will, however, not be able to play unless there is an injury in the squad. The Australian team is set to fly out for the World Cup on Wednesday. Australia play their opening group stage match against Oman in Barbados on June 6. Wrestling Federation of India on Tuesday decided to exempt all six Olympic quota winners from selection trials, but their form and fitness will be assessed at the upcoming ranking series event and the subsequent training camp in Hungary. The WFI said the decision to not hold trials has been taken under peculiar circumstances and should not be used as a precedent in the future. India have got six quotas for the Paris Games, where Aman Seherawad will be the lone male wrestler in the fray from the country, while Vinesh Fogart, Antim Pangal, Anshu Malik, Nishathaya and Ritika Huda are the women wrestlers who have qualified.